Walaikum salam wa rahmatullah. Wa rahmatullah. Okay, I got a question um, with regards to the Sikh religion. A lot of people describe Sikhs as our brothers and real Sikhs as good people. As, as though Sikhism is somehow true, the true, a true religion. Um, what can you tell us about Sikhi that the Muslim can recognize that it's not the correct way? And why is it that we have a lot of... Um, Sikhs who are aligning with the far right organizations, to, uh, for example, the EDL. There's a Sikh division of the EDL, and they helped fund Tommy Robinson and gave them the narrative of the grooming gangs. If you could comment on this, I'd appreciate it. Thank you. Jazakallah khair. So uh, that question is obviously directed towards Adnan. Okay, thank you for that question. As far as calling the Sikh uh, people our brothers, they are definitely our brothers in humanity. They are the children of Adam alayhi salam. We believe by default that all humans are the children of Adam alayhi salam, Prophet Adam. So are the Sikhs. Sikhs are part of the human fraternity. So by that virtue, Sikhs are our brothers in humanity. I'm making it very clear. Not in religion. Not in religion. We are not Sikhs and Sikhs are not Muslims. By that virtue, Sikhs are not our brothers in religion. And we are not brothers in religion to Sikhs. So there is a distinction here. So biologically, they are our brothers in that sense because they come from the same father we do, right? But religiously, spiritually, of course, we are apart uh, when it comes to religious values and religious uh, views. With regards to a lot of people, a lot of Sikh people joining uh, EDL, of course, they are unfortunate characters. They don't represent the Sikh community in general. There are noble Sikh people. I know some of them personally. Uh, I even have Sikh friends. Uh, I share I share my passion of history with them. Yeah. Like all the so are you saying the Sikhs are kuffar or not? What any, else? any, listen to me. Any one who doesn't believe in Islam to us. And if so, is, what makes them kuffar? I'm sorry, uh, React, could I ask you not to interrupt the speaker, please? Because he's answering the, your initial question and you sort of interrupted and asked <laughs> two follow-up questions. Apologies, but he's given the impression that they're almost like Muslims. Uh, uh, um, I want sorry, to know, what, um, are they so far? And if so, sorry, what, why? Uh, you, know, you never sorry. said that. You listen, um, clearly, he said we're brothers um, in humanity, but we're yeah, brothers he, in religion. I mean, the very fact that, you know, we're talking about Sikhism, then they are obviously non non-believers. They are obviously not Muslim. That's that goes without saying. But I'm just I, a bit I made it very clear. I made yeah, it very I'm just, clear. I'm just a bit surprised at your um sort of way of interacting. So I'm gonna remove you from the live stream. Uh, no, no, the, no problem. No problem. The, it's, it's okay. Let me, day, let me uh, no, at the end of the day, brothers, um you know, Ustad Adnan is our senior in the Dawah, and even as young youngsters, we respect him. And I just don't like the way that these questions were being put. Um, and in fact, if you've seen his interactions with the Sikhs in the park, you would know his stance. So, of course, um, of course. Yeah, react, you just need to tone yourself down a little bit. Yeah, I think to see the reaction, how Ustad, for example, deals with a specific individual who was actually supporting the EDL, who's a Sikh, and how he deals with those who are genuine Sikhs who've come to disown that individual is clear enough. Ustad Adnan Rashid's position on how and Islam teaches this you know Allah tells us in the Quran you know in chapter 6 Surah Muhammad verse 8 Allah does not forbid you from being just or kind to those who didn't fight you in your account of your faith or kick you out of your houses and Ustad Adnan Rashid is a fine example in the park with his mannerisms his akhlaq his adab towards all kinds of people and let alone seek brothers who've come to the park to disown a this own a specific individual. <laughs> yeah, and I think, I think uh, you know, I understand where Adnan was coming from when he first explained that actually they are our brothers in humanity and because obviously the differences are clear. And secondly, I believe, and I do believe this is the stance of Adnan and others as well, that the history between the Muslims and the Sikhs is actually a barrier for Sikhs to accept Islam and Muslims need to go out of their way to actually show that what Akbar did and what others did is not necessarily what Islam teaches, right? And so, you know, if you have a history with the people, you obviously want to start off with an olive branch. If we yeah. were talking about, I don't know, we were talking about Quakers, you know, I think Adnan would have started in a different way. And I think, you know, that type of 
okay. intellectual, uh, emotional intelligence is needed in the dawah, uh, rather than us starting off with their kuffar. Yeah. Obviously, we know the kuffar. <laughs> That's obvious. We've got three people waiting, yeah? Yes, definitely.